I'm going to show you how to make scrambled chapati. You call it kutu chapatis. Now you're going to take four eggs. You're going to scramble the eggs. And you're going to take cooked chapatis. Eight chapatis. You're going to take two big large onions sliced. This is coriander leaves chopped. Then you're going to take three small tomatoes sliced into small bits. Then you're going to take half a teaspoon of chili powder, five cardamom, five cloves, around four sticks of cinnamon, half a teaspoon of pepper powder, five flakes of garlic, two green chilies, four shallots, small onions, small piece of ginger. You're going to beat the eggs and scramble the eggs right now. You're going to scramble it, put it into a pan and scramble it. Oil in the pan. You're going to pour in the eggs. Put in a little bit of salt and beat it up. And then you scramble it. Okay, you scramble the four eggs, or you can add five eggs at the most. Now it's nearly done. And you're going to put it into a plate. The scrambled eggs. You're going to pound the garlic, ginger, green chilies and the onions together. You're going to pound it well. Just pound it. In a pan and then drop in the pound onions, the chilies. And the garlic, ginger, and stir for some time. You crush the cardamom, the cloves, and the cinnamon. Crush it a little, not too much. Just crush it a little that into the oil and fry a little. Put in the onions, sliced onions. Stir it well. But you don't know you don't need to make it brown, you just have to make it little tender and cooked. Just keep stirring. I'm going to roll out the chapatis and slice it into lengthy pieces. The whole thing together and slice it lengthwise. Do thin long pieces like this. The onions are nearly done. You have the scrambled eggs, you have the chapatis to mix in. All sliced now. Your onions are nearly done. The onions, the flavor, the smell, the smoke is coming of masalas. You drop in the chili powder and the pepper powder. Stir a little. Macho pieces, small, small, tiny pieces. Let's 
looking yummy and spicy you drop in the chapati pieces into the pan and mix and then you see for taste if there's enough salt mix it all well mixing it well tilting it over and over so that the masala gets all over the chapatis and the scrambled eggs into the chapatis and mix it well it gets blended well all over the chapati and the masala gets well into it the flavor it's getting done the smell is coming out you're going to have wonderful kottu chapati kot chapati scrambled chapati done it's very colorful Kerala is known as God's own country and you get all the fresh vegetables, the organic vegetables right from the garden. And there you are on your table. You, now you can put it into a serving plate. You are, now you're going to garnish it with the coriander leaves on top. There you are, it's all ready and done, hot. You're going to garnish it with coriander leaves on top. See, it's delicious. Gonna have a wonderful time eating this scrambled chapati. I hope you can try it again. And if you have any doubts, please write to me. Enjoy chapatis. Thank you.